that shit pissed her off last night during the fight. Like after the okay. breakup, I had my editing program open and I was working on a video. So I was like, I just put my headphones on, and started, started working, started working, and she's took the like took them off my head. I'm like, well, what are you doing? We're done. I'm moving on. This is what I have to do. I wasn't even like trying Man. to do that to be petty. I was just like, yeah. this is what if we're broken up. Like I got shit to do. Yeah, she was still that in your really place. bothered. Me. Yeah, she stayed. She stayed there, arms crossed, like crying, like still like with the expect. Like, why do you not even care about me? Like, you just broke up. Right. I don't have to care about you anymore. Right. And I do, but you don't get that. You don't get that anymore. You don't. You don't deserve it. Yeah. yeah. You don't. You. You've said that this is not important. What's in? It, it's funny because we, we. I mean, I don't know if we talked about, but it was like I had. I said to. I, we had the conversation, and I said you cannot. You cannot just talk, and then you get the doe eyes, or the teary eyes, and they don't respond. Like you can, and yeah. I say this with girls too. Like make. You make them make a declaration. If you're saying this is what is what makes me happy and this is what I need, do you understand that? And you don't get a. Re- I don't stop until I get a. I don't until I get a response. Mm-hmm. Yes, I do understand that. Okay. So now what you so do there's is no. You, uh, there's no later on. There's no ignorance. To right. That you can't claim because you you strengthen the social contract. Right. You are expanding and strengthening the social contract because you can't say that you didn't know there wasn't a misunderstanding. Yeah, I heard you say that, but I didn't really think you meant no. You heard me say it, and I asked you for a confirmation that you understood. You said you understood, and then you did what you wanted to do. So now you have to go because you violated any sense of. Uh, any sense of of of, of, of good decency, you yeah. know, you you breach the contract, and 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 the same thing goes with like I I can't tell you how many times dude called me. He was like you, you know, um, I was dating this girl and then she broke up with me, but she called me up and said she misses me, and I go, but did she say she she said that she didn't want to deal with you no more? Yeah, but she called me, but she also said that she missed me. Okay, so she missed you, but she doesn't. I like. Stop so which one are you picking in that scenario? I heard it all last you night. All, heard- you always pick the worst. And the reason why you pick the worst is because even if you don't believe it, what you want to do is you want her to, you want her, just, and not, I shouldn't say her. You want the person, your significant other, to understand that what comes out of their mouth is significant and it's and it means something. And it has mm-hmm. consequences. And it has consequences. And yeah. so if you say, I don't ever want to see you again, then you got to go, okay, fair enough. Then because why are you here? Not, then, because, if you, because if you as a man violate that agreement, whatever she's saying, then she, has, she gets carte blanche to keep saying, I'm going to end this, you know, make false threats. Yeah. yeah. And then you're in a situation where now what each of you is saying doesn't mean anything and it's not honest and you can't be held accountable either way and that doesn't work either way. It's like so, the fifth time she's broke up with me, like the the fifth the fifth, right. the fifth time. And I haven't even been dating her that long. Now the 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 problem with that is at some point in time she can't even though she keeps breaking up with you and coming back and you kind of get what you want at some point in time her breaking up with you that has to be more offensive than anything else like we've made this agreement now you're breaking up and then you come back because so now you feel now there's still a level of manipulation in the fact that she can leave say all kinds of hard scream and holler snatch your headphones off your head and then come back so even that's not okay. Like, if no. you want to leave, you can leave. If you want to stay, you can stay. But even if you stay, you have to stay with a level of respect that I that I will not tolerate. And that's, and that it's just a waste of time. It's yeah. just a yeah. waste of time and energy. So this is, like, the fifth time. Is she living with you or no? No, nah, no. Nah, okay. Nah. But she, it was over the phone before. Like, But this time, like, she packed up everything. I think she really meant it. I don't even think it was, like, a manipulation tactic. I think she genuinely thought, like, yeah, I'm leaving. Until it until you let her go. Yeah. Then that's when you really see. You and know. I knew that shit was gonna happen too. Like I just, I was wait, I was smiling. I, I couldn't stop laughing the whole time. Of the tears, the hollering, like though I just, I can't take that shit seriously. It just seems like a movie scene. It doesn't. Well, because sometimes real. it depends on who the person is. If you're wondering if she's legitimately hurt, that's one thing. No, she was, you... she was, but it was still funny in a way. <laughs> like her, like crying on the street. Like this is like people are watching us. Like, it's just funny. Like, you're like we're well, that couple people right people now. People do this. Wow. Yeah. Huh. Shit. <laughs> this it's is funny. real. I've this seen is happening. this in movies. Yeah, this is a movie scene. This is well, a... it's interesting because, and this is men, women, and otherwise, there's always there's three levels of, uh, this is another one, of, I, you know how I keep telling you I got a thousand videos in me? Um, manipulation comes in three le- in three three stages. Anger, guilt, and sympathy. 
right? So first it's like you the you cheated on me, motherfucker, and then when you when you meet that with calmness, it's like how could you do this to me? All that I've done for you, I've been there for you. You cheated on me before. Then when it's not that, it's like look at me, I'm a broken woman. I'm and then I'm saying, consoling her after all the evil shit. I'm the one like rubbing her back right, and like whatever. It's, well, it's whatever gets to you. It's a different tactic, but, it, but, but whatever it's, applies it's not, it's, to you. And but you gotta understand, you. it always happens in that order: anger first, guilt second, sympathy third. And then when you don't give sympathy, when you go, look, we broke up. You, I don't know why you're still here, and you continue to to the edit or whatever then she smacks the headphones off your head because she's mad at you well, she goes back to anger because she's you she was so pathetic and you didn't even care that she was pathetic yeah. so now she's mad at you again yeah and it's like ah, nah, nah, nah. then it's like all that i've done with you yeah. then it's like look at me and then it goes back again and if you let oh it go God. it just keeps going around and it's around exactly and like exactly what happened yeah and so it's, it's funny. crazy that you're able to predict that like Exactly, spot on. I kept thinking about your that image that you you had that she threatened to leave and she packed the suitcase. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. And then slowly, like every day, put it, put a t shirt will go it, back, then the go, jeans will go back. Then it just what well, it's because people think they're very different. People think everybody thinks they're special and mm. they're different and they're not. Everything that you did today, somebody's done it before. Every there's been a girl who screamed and hollered and cr- ran down the street and cream and called you. That's why it's funny because it doesn't. It feels like this is so predictable. This yeah. is a cliche. But it's but it's, all it's not. It's do predictable that. because you had the knowledge to kind of step back and go. This is why you're acting like oh, this. Oh, this is oh. My man just told me he was going to do this, yo. Yeah. I was so excited because she was like, you're not even going to walk me back to the train. I'm like, no, nah, I don't owe you anything. So fine. Like, I was just trying to get her out of my apartment. Like, just go. All right, I'll walk you to the train. I was planning on just walking away. And I was so excited for that moment because I knew she was going to run. You said that. Well, we, she yeah. was going to run back. And I, I heard did, the I footsteps did. and I, I started told you, cracking I told, up. I did tell you that. You tell me that exactly, back, like word right. for word. Yeah. But uh, now you have to decide, and this is up to you, whether you want to continue this or I not. Do, I, do. I do. I do. Oh, this pattern? This pattern? Nah. Because well, now right. she accepted it. I, I, I said straight up, like, this is what uh, I need. She might loop back oh, she's around. Gonna loop she's back gonna around. loop back around. But you just have to be. You gotta be. You gotta be responsible. Young man, school two o two. Better hear what I've got to say because you won't get it again. I'm not an alpha male. I'm not a beta male either. I'm just a better man. Better man. Well, put your happiness first, because if you don't, they won't.